Hello to all my friends out there. It's really sunny here. It's not hot, but it's just sunny. Okay, so the car living continues. So now I'm getting somewhere. Okay, my I told my son, my friend's husband flew to Hawaii, bought a car, lived on the beach. That takes care of baths. What do we have in California, in San Diego? The beach. Showers are not a problem here. Just go swimming in the beach and you're no paying $10 for a shower. When I first started this, I couldn't think of that. I am learning, learning, learning. So my friend's husband moved to Hawaii. He bought seven clothes and seven cans of pork and beans. And, and he did this for a year and a half. Then, uh, and he lived in his car and he found a job and they let him park in back of his job. And he, he made friends and for a time they would let him uh, sleep on the couch. And I said to my son, wow, you know, so this has been in the back of my mind for a while. I said, wow, you know, I said to my son, I would like to do that. And he goes, you know what happened, mom? You would move to Hawaii and pretty soon you'd be living just like you are now. And that is so true. So now what happened today? I was at McDonald's. I drove to Walmart and what did I find? How about this? Markdown sandwiches, $2. So, you know what? I would be doing exactly what I, this is more than enough food for a day. Sandwich and a small fruit and a small vegetable. Then, what I do with it? Look at this. Right next door to the Walmarts is a, this is um, a raisin and uh, oatmeal cookie. And so, what I did is I bought the biggest one. Okay, so now. What I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing some day trips in my car. I will buy my food or bring my food or eat some canned food. And I will show you guys. I will be doing that soon. Okay, so now about sleeping in your car. You can download apps that tell you exactly where truck start stops are. And you should be able, if you're not obnoxious, if you just get into the back of your car, lay down, sleep, and, and then leave when you're not sleeping, basically the problem of living in a car is where to sleep. So um, you can download uh, free campgrounds or low cost campgrounds. A lot of the, uh, also subscribe to Cheap RV Living. Now what they do that I really don't like is they camp out with the boiling sun. Generally I park in the shade. Look at this, I got an offer on my buttery brown leather midsize uh, handbag. I will take that offer. Okay, so, uh, and they only asked for a reduction of a couple dollars. <laughs> so, um, this is why I like eBay. It works while you don't. Okay, so I would never work for somebody else again. Never, never, never. Okay, so free free truck stops, truck, truck stops, uh, rest stops, uh, free campgrounds, those are good. Also, casinos. Now, the thing about the truck stops, uh, the casinos, and the rest stops is you have a bathroom. I think one of the things that would get you in the biggest trouble of all is going to the bathroom in your car. First of all, you might mess your car up, and then you got to live in there. Uh, if you go to the bathroom outside and you get caught in San Diego, that's indecent exposure. So, you know, that's out. I know people do it, but uh, I'd rather not. Uh, you know, just the idea of, of you can get into the swap meet when it closes two days a week and use their bathroom to wash up. They're, they're not, you would find places, parks are kind of gross, but you know, it's not paying for stuff, even in life, that you can get free. So, um, pretty soon, I will be going on some day trips. Okay, you guys, and don't forget, you know, you can eat this food in your house as well. You can stockpile food in your house. Okay, you guys, please like, comment, and subscribe, and God bless you all.